Okay, here I'm going to show how to take, uh, this is going back to, this is Thursday afternoon at 10.41 a.m. Um, I'm on the Thinkorswim on-demand platform. Um, look at SPY. So implied volatility is up a little bit here. Um, so say you're looking to trade, make a trade to the downside on SPY just to cover an account. This will work for any other, any option. Um, but I'm going to show how to do the several different basic option trades. Um, how to sometimes use selling call side premium to reduce the cost. And it'll show you your max risk and everything, your max reward, um, but you can do this with any stock. So we're going to go trade. This is on Thinkorswim, um, SPY, so you can always pick the date. Um, let's go to October 16th. Um, let's say we think, uh, I think there's a gap at 326. And then there's support down at 320. So what you're going to do here is either way you can do buy a, you have to make sure you have it right, pull around, buy an iron condor. So we want to buy a 327 put. We want to sell a 320 put against it as our take profit area. And to go back to um, why we want to sell some premium to reduce price, one implied volatility has jumped up. Um, so we can sell above the highs, you know, we can sell 360. We're not going to get a ton of premium there, but um, it'll reduce the cost. We don't think it's going to break this. Bearish rectangle, whatever, we can sell 342. Um, and we're going to sell the 342. And so, whatever the short call is, let's do 342. And you need to cover yourself with the call. So, however wide this spread is going to be, is this is going to be the risk. So if you have a $3 strike, you have a $300 risk. Um, so $300, but it reduces our price to $0.67 cents or $67. So if we didn't have this on, we just had this doing nothing. This is $177. Um, so if you don't really think price is going back up to a certain area, you can take advantage of selling some premium into it. And so this is any stock. Um, it allows you to put like a stop out area. Um, so 